So, hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm with such a Greg. Hi everybody. <laughs> Hi everyone. So today we'll be discussing the topic self-worth. A lot of people actually have a misconception of what self-worth and what self-esteem is, and they always think it's the same thing, but actually self-worth and self-esteem are not the same. So today I'll be discussing with Sergio Gretchiri, give us our own explanation of what self-worth is and how she has actually uh, built our own self-worth. So before we get start, started, if you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel, this conversation with Shego, where we come back. We are not trying to be right here, we are just starting a conversation. So if you finish, if you enjoyed the video, uh, go to the comment section, comment on or tell us what you mean what's your own what self worth means to you and if you like if you like the video click on the like and the subscribe button and help share it too. so today let's get started okay. so such a what does self worth mean to you what do you what does it mean to have self worth i feel like self worth is a feeling that comes from within it's a like it's like an internal state of being whereby you understand yourself you love yourself and you accept yourself that makes you know your worth in your maybe group of friends and in the society at large. And by knowing your worth, it, like nothing anybody does will matter to you. So far you know your worth and your value, okay. then you'll be able to place yourself in that like realm that nothing anybody does will be able to prick you or be able to like tell you what to do or what not to do. So I feel like, yeah, that is self-worth. Okay, uh, I, to me, what self-worth means is having this level of knowing who you are. Uh, when, I did, when this person sang this song, uh, Kali, that was Know Your Worth, and he was singing, you actually know who you are, like know what you want as a person, know who you are as a person. Know, uh, so, but oftentimes people actually misunderstand what uh self-worth or what self and self-esteem is and is actually very different because self-esteem has to do with moments like um if you're in a bad situation or if you're in a moment where you're having you are down and you your self-esteem is being questioned that's at that moment you're having low self-esteem and it's an internal uh, external so low self-esteem has to do with your environment your external uh feeling or what you are feeling at the moment that what self what is an inbuilt something is from within yeah. is something you can't just even if there's no hope or there's nothing you know how much you want that there's they always give this example of if you lose everything like if you have nothing else do you know how much you want like do you know how to make all those things back will you lose your money your possession or what makes you feel uh, powerful at the moment or what makes you feel better or what makes what gives you this esteem do you know how much you want without all those things so that's basically the difference between self-worth and self-esteem and okay uh now mm -hmm. what are the uh how do we how do we increase our own self-worth as a person or how do we actually know what we are worth as a person okay. yeah since it's like a feeling from within i feel like you first of all have to accept who you are yeah. like most people struggle with this feeling of acceptance of who they are and then i feel like that is the first stage like that's the first thing you have to do to have your self-worth you have to accept who you are like know that yes this is who i am and yes i accept that this is who i am i accept that i am such a great <laughs> i accept that you struggle yeah. so yeah you have to first of all accept who you are and then have understanding sorry yeah, yeah like those two kind of like going like you have to understand yourself and then accept that yes this is who i am and this is the kind of person I am, and then you love yourself. Like yeah. self love is like what you <laughs> need. You need to love yourself before any other person can love you. And I feel like even when you want to love someone else, you have to love yourself first. Like, don't love somebody more than the way you love yourself. <laughs> love yourself. Give yourself that love because you you deserve it. We all deserve self love. So yeah. Yeah, I feel uh, self worth too has to do with the fact that 
you knowing that you deserve certain things in life, certain things that comes with life, love, mm -hmm. knowing that you deserve the love no matter who you are, knowing that you deserve to be accepted, knowing that you deserve to be rich, you deserve to be celebrated as a person, even if you think, uh, even if you think it's small win, no matter how small that win is, I think exactly. we all deserve that celebration, we need to be, we need to celebrate us. There are times that you feel that um, uh, you want to check, you want to compare yourself with someone who has already maybe your age bracket and you're not looking at that person like, ah, that person has more this or that or this or that. But if you always think that that person didn't have, uh, you didn't get the opportunity that person has, and so you shouldn't be comparing yourself with that person. And you should celebrate that small win, as small as, it's, uh, as it comes. Celebrate it. You deserve love. We all deserve acceptance. We all deserve love. We all deserve uh, to be to celebrate small, small wins. So that I think is one of it. And I also remember this. Uh, if you watch Scandal, for people that love Scandal, <laughs> she has really watched Scandal. I, you should actually watch it. You should watch it. So there was this episode where uh, Olivia, Olivia Pope was kidnapped and. What she did, the the people that people that kidnapped her knew was what she was worth as a person to the president, then to the country, the information she had. So the point where they wanted to kill her, uh, she she now told them that to bargain. She now bargained with the other people that why don't they bid her off? Because she was very sure of who she was, and they found out that she was what <laughs> almost a billion. A billion dollars which was a lot and the americans think that if she was being, uh, if she was being bought by any other country that they can actually use the information she has as a person to actually destroy america so they were even ready to kill her to show how worthy her level of self worth so we should not we should all uh, we should always know as a person that we are worth something we should not just assume i'm not worth anything most people they will say uh, I can sell myself for this <laughs> for a very ridiculous price, and I don't blame them. It's the uh, their own understanding of who they or what they want. I guess that's where it comes from too. So that's basically it. So uh, is there a word of advice for someone out there who is struggling with ease or self words? I feel like you should just learn to accept yourself the way you are, and everybody can be something. Everybody is worth. Is worth everything. Yeah, yeah. Your worth is like very high. It's just for you to to understand yourself and accept yourself, and then know that yes. Yeah, I feel. I feel you. also we should always take responsibility after the uh, loving and accepting yourself. We should take resp uh, responsibility for our actions, for what that we should take control of our own life. Exactly. That if this happens, I'm the one in in control of the good and the bad things in my life so i should accept that and i know that it's, i'm building myself like there are so many people who have gone through so many things and they won't i don't think people should change anything if you say is there anything you want to change i don't think they should change anything because if they don't go through that certain situation in their life or they don't go through or pass through that uh, moment they will know they won't know their actual worth or they won't know how come how they are able to survive that moment so I think everyone should always understand that everything you are going through, you are the one in control of that. And of course, put your life in the life of God. God is also in, your, in the control yes. of your life. So God is the ultimate person. So I guess that's it. So today's advice is know your self-worth. Improve on your self-worth. Don't let someone come and don't let that moment, that sad, that moment, that exact moment, make you feel you are not worthy of love or acceptance. Everyone is worthy of love or acceptance. Everyone is worthy to be celebrated. Know that everyone is worthy to be celebrated. So, thank you very much for coming to my channel to speak. Thank you too for having me. <laughs> it was a pleasure. It's very nice. So, don't worry if you want to follow her. I'll put her. Uh, as such as in the description <laughs> below uh whatsapp no i won't go on instagram or twitter 
and our Snapchat account. Each other has uh, this thing. I don't think I can see my Snapchat. <laughs> the name, like, <laughs> the name is very, very. So I'll just put that uh, Instagram and Twitter. Twitter. So you can follow her. You can help her out. <laughs> so thank you thank you guys like don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you and please share this video